All right, time now for an all new edition of Taste of the Town. John Martin's Irish Pub and Restaurant was a go to destination of Coral Gables for roughly 30 years until it closed in 2020. That landmark location was founded by John Clark and Martin Lynch, a couple childhood buddies from Ireland shortly after they moved to Miami in 1989. Seems like a great place, and John Martin has recently reopened, but under new ownership. CBS4's Lisa Petrillo takes us there. Slancha. Nothing like a nice cold Guinness. It was known as the quintessential Irish pub, a local landmark and watering hole founded in 1989 and then COVID closed it in 2020. Now, John Martin's Irish pub and restaurant has had a facelift, a complete renovation lasting two years, keeping some signature elements the same behind the completely refreshed bar, now with some 300 Irish whiskey brands. Regulars will recognize the historic centerpiece from the original millwork. We wanted them to feel like they could recognize part of the venue, but also upgrade it for the new generation. And hopefully we'll be around for another 30 years. Michael Venus was one of the first long timers to come back. But it still has that old feel and I still feel like I'm at home here. We want to make them feel like this is their cheers per se for those that remember the show from back in the day. So or everybody knows your name. name. Yep. As for the menu, old favorites are all back with added options. And for us, we, we wanted to not only bring back what was traditional, just add a, a touch of the local flair. We begin our tasting with their classic full rack of baby back ribs soaked in a homemade Irish whiskey based barbecue sauce with a side of potatoes and street corn elote. So I know I have to describe it, but I want to keep eating, unfortunately. These are amazing fall off the bone ribs. So tasty, and that kind of tastes a little bit of that Irish whiskey. Yeah. Well, you know, this is what happens. Yeah, uh-huh. Can't just Sorry. around it. Next, new to the menu, mini pork also buco with baby watercress and an orange chili glaze. It's a surprise because you think it's chicken, it's yep. pork. There's a tenderness and a juiciness to that pork, and then that sweet savory on top. It does. It's definitely unexpected flavor. It, it, it really pops. Next, we try the colossal and delicious Guinness burger with dry aged beef topped with beer brat sausage, Guinness beer cheese, and crispy potatoes on a pretzel bun. Before moving on to the restaurant's famous fish and chips, it's beer battered cod with French fries and mushy peas. So I went to Ireland a few years back. Yep. This is every bit as good, if not more. Oh, wow. That's great. I that mean, means a lot. It's delicate, and it. soft, and Appreciate juicy. It. So as they say in Ireland, Swancha. Swancha. <laughs> Tell me how many days you're open here at John Martin's. We're open seven days a week, serving lunch and dinner. All right, with a fantastic Taste of the Town here in Coral Gables, I'm Lisa Petrillo, CBS 4 News.